All right, so I'm supposed to take today off, but as you know, things always keep moving in DeFi. If I could get this stupid thing to work. Nope, there we go. Well, that's pretty far out there. Ah, uh, man, I got like, I don't want to buy, I'm too cheap to buy a new camera, so I guess I'll just have to do it like that. <sighs> see, see now, now I seem off center. This is so annoying. I guess we're just gonna have to leave it like this, man. Does this work? No, that just makes it worse. Oh my god. How do I fix this stupid problem? This is so annoying. Alright. Yeah, good enough. Oh, jeez. Alright, I'll figure it out some other time. So, anyway, I'm supposed to take today off, right? <clears throat> but, you know, things always uh, move pretty quickly. And, of course, you could see the thingy on the upper right corner. All right, and then char chart, blah, 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 blah. So, anyway, uh, so the people running Poseidon Black actually created their own Titano fork out of thin air. It actually turns out we actually have some uh, developers, or I guess the team members from Titano, also in the Elite Discord. I won't really say who, though, you know, because obviously it's supposed to be kind of a secret group, right? And yes, I know a lot of you keep asking, how do I join? You don't. <laughs> okay? It's an elite secret group for a reason. Okay? You know, you'll hear about it, but, you know, it's invite only. Okay? You don't... I mean, maybe we could charge people for it, but... Eh, I don't know. It's like... We're not really looking for money. Alright? Because I don't think you can give us enough money to, you know, do whatever. Right? We, you know, we're, we're looking for, like... It's a mastermind group, right? So, you're, you're, you are the sum of the ten closest people that you hang out with. I think you can include online on the internet, too. That counts as a person, because your brain is obviously associating with somebody, right? Like, think of it this way. If you're watching, like, Jesse Lee Peterson all the time, right? Well, who, do you, who are you going to become? Kind of like Jesse Lee Peterson, right? I mean, that, and that's the point. If you watch, like, I don't know, Moon Moon or XQC all the time, who, who do you become? You be kind of you might wind up a little bit like them, right? I mean that's kind of like the same thing, right? <clears throat> so if you're a homeless bum and you hang out with other homeless bums, <laughs> I think you get the idea, right? So anyway, uh, so anyway they just threw up this website. It's obviously not the greatest looking site. There's really just not much to go by. Uh, obviously they stealth launched literally last night. So you know I got in on a, at an average price of like I don't know. Somewhere around here, sub two cents, all right, something like that. Hilariously enough, we're worth more than Caesar for now. <clears throat> so, on the one hand, stealth launches are nice because, you know, it avoids the super predators and the whales. But, of course, I'm now realizing there is a downside. Because there's no hype and stuff, your trade volume eventually goes down pretty quickly. And then, of course, uh, your treasury, you know, is kind of an issue. Now, I'm not sure if this treasury value thing is actually accurate, so I think what's happening is they're just simply calculating the value of all their Raven tokens in here. And of course, you know, they're just getting their website up, so there's not really much to go by. And I'll actually have to look at this, but yeah, it's pretty much your standard Titano fork. Uh, funny enough, I actually decided to go on Fiverr. All right, and then yeah, I actually found all the developers. Now the good news is the developers charge a lot of money, and they look pretty good too. Um, and I'll just say they look like they're from Europe. All right, I gotta be careful what I say here, so I don't actually trigger you know YouTube. So that's a very good sign. So I definitely know that they're hiring. Everyone's hiring smart people. It's hilarious. I actually see a lot of the projects I've covered on this channel listed as their uh, uh, portfolio 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 or their resume on fiverr it, it's actually pretty hilarious so i'm gonna try to see if this works <clears throat> so anyway this is basically just gonna be a quick video because there's not really much to go by and i forgot that i'm uh and i kind of want my og role i don't know if they're gonna do a giveaway right i mean i don't know if they have any money for that but anyway i'm gonna leave an invite for the uh, discord link because i didn't actually mention this yesterday actually you can't see because my yeah, and I also have Reddit as well. <clears throat> so, I didn't mention this yesterday, but on Novus New Order Finance, the one thing I... Oh, yeah, actually, I did mention. I actually did a live on stream. I don't remember, right? I asked if they would make a Discord, right? So far, they haven't done that. They still want to stick to Telegram. So, 
that is kind of like, you know, somewhat of a problem. Now, so far they haven't rug pulled, right? New Order Finance, but, you know, in fact, it, it's actually up today. It's actually up to almost $42. So, all right, you know, we'll see. You know, we'll see. Uh, we'll see how this goes. <clears throat> So anyway, everything's going pretty well. Tomb Forks are, of course, doing whatever they normally do. Again, I actually think a taxation system, Tomb Forks with low inflation and more than 12 months shares distribution. So instead of 12 months, you distribute it over like 40 years or something. I just have the same uh, sh a number of shares distributed every month. So, you know, that way you don't have to keep wasting money and time creating new layers after new layers and then con confusing everything. And your tax system is actually what gives you all your treasury income. So anyway, <clears throat> I think as, you know, Poseidon Black uh, and them, you know, continue, you know, working on Poseidon Black. Of course, now they have Raven Black. Uh, you know, I imagine they'll probably create another Tomb Fork for this project, too, eventually. So it would be a good, because right now we, I mean, I know Poseidon gave the announcement saying that they're going to move to AVAX, right? But that'll just take, you know, whatever, right? So what do we do in the meantime? They'll actually a lot faster and cheaper, ironically enough, to you create your own tomb, for, tomb fork. Oh, you know, yes, tomb fork, but also your own titano fork, right? On a better blockchain. So in this case, this is on Binance uh, Smart Chain, right? BFC. And they just create a tomb fork for that too, and then that way you don't have to wait around Poseidon. Because Poseidon's going to keep, the, uh, its price is going to be shit until June 14th. Because, like I said, that stupid ocean project is literally retarded. Right? All it does is create constant sell pressure, and that's why Poseidon is, like, worth almost nothing. You know, which is good for, I guess, you and me, because now we can acquire all the Poseidon for basically, for free. So... Anyway, you can check out Raven Black. I bought a... I'm not going to say how much I bought, but I, I bought like a moderate to small to moderate bag. I didn't put too much in, but I put in way more than 200 bucks, but less than 1000 so I'll leave it at that. And I'm going to go let this thing, uh, you know, do its little thing. I'm even thinking about creating my own little uh, of these forks, too, but I don't know. I'm not going to have to market it. I have to waste a lot of money up front, which I don't have right now, and... I mean, it may not even be worth it for me to do something like that. It's, it's just a problem, right? Because I have to waste so much time creating marketing. It's like, you know what? It's just it's just safer for me to just go from project to project, right? You know, it's, it's kind of like starting a business versus having a job. Funny enough, in DeFi, maybe having the job, aka investor, is much be better and safer. Because you just go in and out, right? And if you choose to stay, then you just stay. But you're not responsible for anything except your own your own money so anyway uh obviously this site is bare bones minimum so so if it were i mean i probably would have still covered it anyway but because i know who's uh, actually in charge of making this project then i know that it can be safe so the only real risk is a uh, code risk but i assume that poseidon black used the same developer that he's using to create basic black so I looked at his Fiverr profile. I mean, he, it looks all right. I mean, there's not a lot of people on Fiverr actually doing these projects, but they charge a good amount of money, right? A thousand dollars up to thirty-nine hundred dollars is the specific one I think they're using. Uh, you know, I looked at his physiognomy. Looks pretty good. Uh, I don't know. Should I really show you what I found? Uh, let me think about that real quick. I mean, it's technically out in the public, right? So, of course, I mean, some of you clowns might want to create your own. But that's the thing. I don't know if I want all of you specifically also paying four grand to create your own forks. Because there's already a lot of other people doing it. And there's actually more risk to everyone, including yourself. Because you actually know how to market it, right? You know, you can't rely on someone like me or Dow King, right? Or, you know, whatever, Renzo, YouTuber, right? I mean, it's obviously nice, but ultimately, you know, you still have to constantly... Because I don't know what you have to do, right? You just have to constantly... I don't know how you get the word constantly out there, right? And then you have to think about tokenomics, burns, you know, all that stuff. So, I don't know, man. It, it, it's a lot of work. So, I kind of don't want to just start encouraging people to make their own forks. Especially if you don't know what you're doing, right? So, yeah. 
But anyway, I already checked that out on Fiverr. I mean, if you're really that like, curious, you could try just type figuring it out on your own, right? Just go on the Fiverr.com website and then I'm not gonna tell you the search term, but I'm sure you sure some of you a lot of you with like at least half an IQ brain can, you know, figure it out and see for yourself, right? Ah, but um yeah. Well we'll see how this goes. Don't put as always, alright, don't put too much in here because have you noticed what's happening to Seifu? Right? Now, I have no idea what the hell is going on with that project, because I know Certic kind of, like, cucked them, and then now they're kind of angry. I think one of their developers is in our Elite Discord, and he's, like, very angry all the time. So that's already kind of a... I think his name is Liru or something, like, L-I-R-U. I, I don't even know... I don't know who, who the hell is who, but either way, I, like, I originally did not want to invest in Seifu because it was too expensive. Right. I didn't even think something I didn't even think uh it was related to Seifu, but apparently it is, so yeah. Actually what is Seifu at right now? Uh $162.38. So it's good to see that he hasn't abandoned the project yet, but man, it's like uh they're just asking for trouble at this point. So it's like, you know, I'd rather not deal with it. <laughs> right, when it comes to Seifu. I mean, but if other people are going for it, I mean, you know, all right, good, I mean, good luck, I guess, but, you know, there's just so many other, like, project alternatives, so, I don't know. Anyway, I'm done for the day. I'm supposed to take Teddy off, but I thought I'd throw this out there for you. So, yeah, a lot of Titano forks, and then hopefully tomorrow I'll cover, uh, you know, some more Tomb forks, and then, you know, I'll take another day off on the weekend or something. I've been working uh, kind of hard, but... Yep, 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 yep. All right, so check this out. Don't put too much money in here as usual. Uh, I guess just join my Discord link just, if you want to just join their Discord. All right, we gotta like grow the community and stuff. Um, also, I kind of want my OG role too, so I don't know. And if there's like a giveaway contest, I kind of want my invites to also be there so I can get a little bit of money out of this. <laughs> All right, anyway, check it out. And yeah, like, subscribe, share, uh, go to the Discord, etc. Because again, there's Right now, there's just not much to really show. <laughs> I I don't know. Is this even actually on... Can I refresh this page? Yeah. Uh, what do I type? Raven? Totally misspelled Raven. Raven Black. Oh, yeah. It's already listed here. March 23rd. Okay. Discord, the, the Telegram, Twatter, and, of course, the website. Jesus Christ. There's, still, like, so many of these. So here's the thing, how do you really know which one of these are, like, you know, legit, you know? And here's the thing, too, there's, like, so freaking many. What? <laughs> yeah, so here's the thing, devs abandoned after pre-sale canceled. Oh, okay, well, at least they did the right thing and didn't take people's money. They just simply shut down. Mm, Aurum Protocol. Yeah, everyone's already on here. Let's just look at one of these random projects. Yeah, see, here's the thing. How do you know any of these are any good, right? Because there's just like 11... See, this website doesn't even freaking load. Okay, you're on Binance Smart Chain. Oh, this is like another... I want an actual Titano fork. I don't want a Seifu style fork. All right, Seifu. Venice Dow. Uh, coming soon, Venice Dow. Inspired by Titano... Okay, they've got no. Oh, okay. Can I? Uh, I wish they would have some sort of sorting here. All right, let me see. You got Aranos. I can't believe these guys are still around. F Libero. Oh, yeah, that's Libero though, right? Hi. Wait. Oh, is this the Phantom version of Libero? Uh, oh wow, there's a phantom version of Libero. Really? Is this actually the real Libero though? Oh, I might have to wind up doing a second video after all. Uh, uh <clears throat> I don't know, it looks kind of correct. What? Am I following the action? Okay, hold on. We gotta go to the... We gotta make sure this isn't like a fake website. So here's Libero Financial, right? 
which has almost holy shit, they have way more people. Um Okay, here we go. So it says F liberal and W liberal are coming to support our aggressive growth expansion plans by now when it is still early. Okay, so they did mention F liberal. They're now trending on Dex tools. Uh, I am waiting for the launch of F liberal. I plan to invest a good amount of the team. Okay, well, okay, well. All right, well, I guess. Uh, I guess after you're finished buying uh, Raven, I guess we're going to be buying this shit. <laughs> Alright. God, this is on Phantom, though. They said there was also a W, too. Oh, great. Um, okay, I'm hoping they link to their chart. I know they normally do that. Oh, the pre-sale is March 25th, so it's not even out yet. Pre-sale on Phantom Thorium ITO. Well, I know that they're not a scam, right? Because we just checked to make sure it's the real... So it looks like it's the actual liberal site. Because they even mentioned on their own actual Twitter, so... Uh, the 15% discounted price. Uh, what is this for? Whitelist spot. Oh man, I don't really want to deal with stupid whitelist spots. Uh, they are launching March 28th. Well, I guess I'll be just. Oh, man. I mean, I could probably buy some. Well, let me think. What do you think the price of this is going to be? Because there's no. Uh, as far as I can tell, there's no bridging yet. So theoretically, this should still be cheaper than buying the. Okay. So I would actually, what's March 28th? So that's next month, this coming Monday. Huh, that's some pretty interesting choices to make. I could actually save up my money instead, get ready to buy F Libero on this coming Monday. And I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna buy, I'm just gonna buy the open thing. I kinda wish they would just do the open, the IT law, ITO. Yeah, all right. So we'll definitely, I'm gonna definitely keep this in the the content queue for sure. So let me add, let me add Libero. What was what was W Libero though? See, guy, you guys are now getting some extra content, but this is good because obviously we're gonna be investing in this shit, right? Or at least I'm going to try. Okay, so. Okay, so all I see, can you guys see this? Yeah, you can see that. All right, so we know that's Phantom, but what's W? Uh, oh, all, all it is is just a, a, a link to just buying liberal on, I assume, Binance Smart Chain. Uh, okay. Anyway, I launch a liberal. Uh, ba ba ba. Okay. One of the tries biggest events of the other was expansion on to Phantom or pre sale. Okay. Yeah, I think people might dump. Well, I mean, Poseidon's already dumped pretty hard, so Libero is now trending number two on Certic 19 hours ago. Yeah, see, despite, uh, despite how much marketing Libero is doing, their price is still kind of s stuck around one cent. That's how tough this stuff is. Uh, joins the order. I don't know what this is. All right, but very cool. Oh, financial joins the order. Uh, they, look, they look like some kind of game, so that's awesome. All right, so I'm yeah, it would make sense for them to only do it one at a time because if you split two launches at once, then you're going to split the money because I don't even know what W Libro is. Like, I, I don't know, W? I don't know any blockchain that starts with the letter W, or even contains. I mean, poly. No, it's not even Polygon. I don't know. Where where, where would W be? People are making bag with liberal or fifty four hundred. Oh, and thank you by the way for the one person that did sign up under my uh, thing and went into the liberal bank. I've actually been uh, cashing out my meager earnings from that. <laughs> so now, so now I've got a small bag of liberal in the in, in the thing. 
With W Lobo, we can bring Lobo on any CEX like Gate.io. This one next far along, and we'll see it in action in April. Oh, okay, I understand. It's not a blockchain. They're wrapping liberal, just like Sphere is. Okay, I got it. Yeah, because you got to be able to transport. Yeah, because you can't actually, you cannot actually uh, put this on a centralized exchange. So they get around that you have to wrap your liberal. That's how Sphere is doing it. So yeah, I forgot what what did Sim call it? Oh, it's like it's wrapped liberal. So yeah, I get it now. I get it. Okay, this is actually really good. Yeah, this is perfect. So once they go live on Phantom, and then they come out with Wrapped Libero, right, this is going to be really effing good. Because centralized exchanges do have one really good thing. They have really good effing marketing if you can get on a big one, especially like Hotbit. Forget it. Sky's the limit. Then you never have to worry about marketing again, right? But you have your tax system, you know, doing its thing. And of course, you know, I thought maybe it could be a problem if you can't, you know, whatever, right? you know, get the tax system from that. But in order for it to wrap your liberal, you also have to buy it in the first place and then wrap it afterwards. And it and because it's wrapped, it's not earning anything. So, you know. So, you know, either way, it's like there's got it's got ups and downs, but I think it should be okay, so we'll see. And of course if it fails, I mean liberal is the one that's taking that risk, right? And I guess eventually sphere too, but Alright, this is very good. Alright, well well so you guys got some bonus content. So we're definitely going to... Well, I'm definitely going to do Libro on Phantom for sure. I'll probably just save up whatever and then, you know, I'll figure out the rest from there. And, you know, we'll see how that goes. But, yeah, that's actually pretty good. They're not... Not only are they going cross-chain, but they're actually wrapping. So it's basically going to become the next sphere. All right? I mean, they're essentially... They're already the next Titan or Sphere because they're only at... Right now, they're at one penny, right? But... You know, uh, thingamajig. Sphere is out basically pushing two cents, so they're not too far behind. So I don't know. I could actually just buy more Libro itself, but that's more expensive. Or I can gamble and just wait for Monday and then buy Libro on Phantom. I think I might actually just try that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, check out Raven Black. We'll definitely come back for Phantom Libro. All right. We'll see how that goes. And then the fact that they already have. Wrapped Libro already in the works as well. They said, I think based on that tweet we just saw, they said it was around April, right? So, yeah. And of course, if they're all hiring people from Fiverr and then also some other actual blockchain specialists from like other, like, I don't know, freelancer.com or something. Yeah, it actually looks, uh, actually looks, uh, you know, looks pretty solid, right? And in the meantime, you know, hopefully Raven, uh, you know, I mean, they're just starting their marketing push, so. Yeah, I'm liking our chances here. I'm liking our chances. I can't believe, did you know that some people in the Elite Discord, they say they're making like five grand a day in DeFi. And here I am making much less because I'm still recovering from freaking Metaverse Pro Congo. It's just like, you know, I'll never get this dildo that shoved up my ass for like a few months now. I'll never get it out of there, man. It's like, you know, it's like... <laughs> You know, I, want, uh, I, can't, I, can't, I gotta endure the pain, right? It's like, you know, because cause God's grace is good enough. Because there was a story in the Bible where Peter was like, oh, I'm in so much pain. Can you please get this thorn out of me, right? Because he was talking to God. God's like, nah, that's all right. You know, my grace is good enough for you. It's like, oh, what? <laughs> that's essentially what it is. So, uh, just gotta endure. All right. Can't last forever, right? No, can't. I just gotta be patient. Uh, been waiting, been patient for a long time, but I'll have to be more patient. I don't know. Let's see. I'm not gonna write down the real number that I have, so I'll just write a kind of big number. Uh, that does not look correct to me at all. How much? Do, what? How much? How much Raven do I actually have? Uh, just give me a second here, guys and gals. Oh, please tell me I've been recording. Yeah, I've been recording. All right. Well, that's my... Uh, oh, great. I did not even... I added... Oh, great. I added the... Okay. Add Raven to my MetaMask. Yes. It's like, I don't know. My, my Raven wasn't showing up on my wallet for some reason. But even though I added it. Uh, 
Okay, this is just completely freaking wrong. Okay. Alright, oh man, this thing is like, yeah, everything is completely wrong, even on my wallet. Oh, God. Yeah, there you go, okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, there, there's definitely a problem with the display of the token right now. Because <laughs> it's th this thing is saying I've got like a few trillion coins or something, that's clearly not correct. And when I go to the calculator here, this does uh, this obviously does not look correct. What do I type in? Three hundred fifty thousand. I don't think this is even correct. Yeah, I'm j even just by eyeballing it, this doesn't look correct. But I don't know. I could be wrong. Is it actually worth that much? Times three hundred fifty thousand Raven clowns. Are you serious? I didn't put that much money in last night. Obviously, I'm not telling you my real numbers, but $1,593? Holy shit. What? Oh, wait. Oh, I was on Chrome when I was doing the calculation, but this is, this is what I have. This is what I have here. What calc? This is what I have. Um, Three hundred fifty thousand times. Yeah, you can still paste. Nope, it's not right. Three hundred fifty thousand times whatever this thing is. Yeah, it's pretty much the same price. And if I hit this. This actually says fifteen ninety two. Holy shit! Well, all I could say is, okay, well, I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I made a lot of money. In fact, I could actually dump all my holdings, right, and essentially make 2x or 3x. I'm obviously not going to do that. I'm not touching a, I'm not touching an effing thing, obviously. Wow. Wow. Even my family member that got them into this, was it last night? Yeah. I, th I think they made money. No, they made they no. They have to buy around this price actually. Holy shit! What the hell did I buy? I, I think I was wrong. I think I bought this at a much cheaper price. There's no way I made this much money, but I mean, there it is. See, that's the great part. I have no idea how much money I made. It's just too. It's just too much, right? Yeah, it's like, oh yeah, I wish I put a bigger bag. Yeah, of course, you know. But there's always, but you know, I I I added a overweighted moderate bag, right? Because that's the rule, right? You don't you don't put all your eggs in one basket. But obviously, the this little basket, you know, is really pumping out coins like you wouldn't believe, right? Oh, and one other thing, right now the price is actually pretty good because of this. I mean, you look at the liquidity pool here. You know, everything's a very small scale right now, so there's ups and downs. So right now we're seeing the benefits of that, which is you know pretty strong price, okay price action. What's the downside? You know, your volume and treasury is going to be kind of low. Because, again, that's kind of what's affecting not only Poseidon, but really Caesar Finance. And it's generally pretty easy to fix. You just got to do more marketing, right? whatever the hell that means. All right. This video has been way too long, but mostly because, you know, I had to devote, like, half of the video, basically, to, like, exploring Libero. So we're definitely going to do that. So I think I'll see you all tomorrow. I really would like to take a day off, but there's, I got to clear the content queue, so... I don't know, I'll just get the videos out of the way tomorrow, or maybe I'll wait till tomorrow's Friday, right? Or maybe I'll wait till Saturday, you know, we'll, you know, we'll see what happens. Alright, that's enough. Alright, see you, blah, 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 blah. Thanks.